Okay, so it's been about four months since the last update, uh, I think, but I'm happy to tell you that BMBF has finally updated to work with version 1.24 of Beat Saber. Um, so let's have a look at the patch notes for 1.24. Um, let's see, now available. H71 Saber levels added across 29 songs, uh, previous songs. Uh, and then it says, previously a major major update added the electronic mixtape featuring 10 new songs from various electronic music artists across different music eras, uh, but there were some bugs and issues with that, so this patch should fix those. Uh, but this came out, you know, the 14th of July. Um, then we've got all these songs listed here. I'm guessing these are the One Saber songs, or some of them. Uh, and then release notes, 87 said maps, uh, boost colours are now part of the colour palette. I don't know what boost colours are, but there you go. Uh, and the anniversary theme was removed from the main menu. Uh, so that's it for the patch notes. So let's have a look over on Discord. Um, so as you can see, uh, this was updated at 10.41pm last night for me here in the UK. Um, but I was busy, so I didn't really get to this till now. Um, so anyway, core mods, uh, cover song, loading and playlist management now being released for Beat Saber 1.24. If you haven't updated yet, uninstall, uninstall Beat Saber using the button in the Tools tab, reinstall Beat Saber, go through BMBF setup, and sync to Beat Saber. If you have already update, updated, ugh, sorry, uh, and got the dreaded no core mods message, Click Check Core Mod Updates in the Tools tab, sync your game and your song should begin working. Um, there's just another one I read on my phone, let me check. Um, so yeah, updating from previous versions of the game will keep all custom levels you had installed. Uh, mods obviously will need to be uh, updated for the new version, uh, we'll look through those in a second. Uh, and it also says, warning, up, updating the game at this moment in time will wipe any saved score data. Um, so you'll need to back up your uh, files and stuff, you know, to keep your saved scores and your uh, character data and stuff like that. Um, so yeah, uh, that's easy to do through side quest though. It's just a few files you sort of save and copy back across. Um, there's a little guide uh, on... I'll post a link in the um, description. Uh, anything else from there? No. So let's go through the mods. Uh, so far we've got Smooth Controller, um, Crash Mod, uh, Chat UI, so that's for Twitch, uh, Third Person Mod, um, Red Bar, um, Random Song Picker. I think this is a new one, I've never seen this before. Just randomly picks a song. Uh, search Fixes, Saber Taylor, uh, Custom Pillows, Image Cover Expander, uh, Difficulty Saver. I think this is a new one as well. I don't think I've seen this one before. Um, faster Scroll, Chroma. Very nice. Can't wait to try some new uh, features with that. Quest Sounds, Clock Mod. Uh, noodle extensions. It says noodle extensions hotfix, but I'm guessing if that's there, then noodles working. So that's pretty good for sort of a day one release of mods. Um, so that's it from there. Uh, I'm still, unfortunately, sticking to 1.17.1 because of the render mod. I don't know if anyone saw my previous video um, that Hemwellite is no longer. Um, working on replay and render and it's been handed over to someone else who I can't remember the name to be honest but they're working on it instead of Hemwell um, so yeah and yeah I think that's about it so I just wanted to get this out quickly uh, so everyone knows that it's safe to update now uh, so thanks Blood in my face, yeah. I love on my face, yeah.